doing this job you know, long enough, you start to get to the point where uh, you're pretty confident, you know, but you want to be safe at the same time. But no matter how many times you do it, your, your adrenaline's still going to start going. It's, your heart's still going to start beating because it's, you know, you're starting to realize you're doing something that's just not normal. And, uh, you know, you can do the job, but at the same time, I mean, you know, my heart was beating pretty good when I was getting ready to, to actually head down because you just never know what's going to happen. All right, check swimmer. Check swimmer. Right before Scott went out, I'm like, Scott, you need to make this fast. We want you to just get him in the litter as fast as you can, get him back in the aircraft, because uh, we're, we're fuel's running low as we speak. Start going down. I was calling the helicopter over, and you know the ship took a couple swells. Right about when the swimmer was going to get on deck, it, uh, it, it, the boat moved a little bit. We moved a little bit. It, it got a little hairy real quick. Um, but the swimmer and I both knew that to get him on deck would have been, it, it had to be done quick. We're going inside, boys. We're going inside. I didn't want to bring too much urgency to the case because you want people to do really do a good job. But I just had to express that to everybody, guys. We got to be Johnny on the spot. We got to get down there. We got to make it happen. We don't have a lot of time to play around because we are running out of fuel as we speak. Doors ready. Okay. Get the list. Doors outside the cabin door. Okay, please. Let's go down. Let's go down. Let's go down. Um, I'm not just focusing on the swimmer. I'm looking at the bow. I'm looking at the waves. And I'm also looking at looking out the back and make sure that the tail's not going to make in contact with anything. As I was getting lower down, I could see that it was pitching pretty good. It was coming up and down, and I started to get a little bit of a swing going on. At one point, the boat came up pretty fast as I was swinging, and I could see the rail coming at me. And so I just kind of picked my feet up as, you know, as much as I could. I did clip the rail going by it, and that kind of got me spinning a little bit. And then when I came back across, then hit the rail again, and then uh, hit the deck. Again. 